I knew that something was up when Dorian let me get away. I thought she was jealous of my female fans, but after I completed my television ad campaign for the good folks at Have a Seat Hemorrhoid Pads, I received a lot of adulation and praise, and my female fans threw themselves at me, naturally. But then I realized it was something more. It had put a strain on my relationship with Dorian. And I saw that Dorian found her true self with Amelia. I couldn't stand in the way of that. I did what any man would do. I stepped aside and I let love live. I think I've got everything I need. Are you sure? I've got more. Would you like more? Thanks for that. Pretending that Dorian is marrying her campaign manager? Oh, you've got to admit, this did up the ante. I don't think Charlie and Vicky are going to be able to beat that. Unless maybe one of them has a sex change. Well, this is about more than beating Mrs. Banks. You obviously don't know Dorian. No, this is about giving everybody the right to be married under the law. I don't know if that's really all it's chalked up to be. A few marriages of mine I wish were illegal. Yeah, but you did it for love, right? Well... Excuse me. You are gay, aren't you? Yes, I, I am. And don't you want the same rights and privileges that everybody else has? You know what I want doesn't really have anything to do with this? No, of course it does. We, we're doing this for you, Oliver. We're doing this for everyone. What, by lying about your feelings? I don't know, I thought, I thought we were past all that. A campaign rally for Dorian Lord turned into pandemonium as the mayoral candidate's niece tumbled from a second-story window to the ground below. Jack, don't watch that. Take me to the hospital. Uh, we are not going anywhere. But, Mom... No, no, your Aunt Dorian left strict instructions for us to stay here. If there is any news, she'll call. Manning residence? Noel. Oh, Dorian. Uh, how's poor Blair? Extremely lucky. Oh, so she's gonna be all right. Landing on that pool cover saved her life. Nothing more than bumps and bruises. Thank God. When's she coming home? They want to keep her here for observation, just to be sure. Let me talk. Let me talk. Dorian, I think Jack needs to hear this for himself. Elijah. Hey, it's Ross. No, no, no. I'm still in land view. Oh. Not until I find out what KS does my kid. I don't care what's advisable. Listen to me. If she won't tell me the truth, I got a pretty good idea where I'm gonna find it. Taya! Oh, sorry. Hey! My mom is she's gonna be okay. Oh, thank God. Hey, Cole. Yeah, there's no broken bones and her back is okay. And she's awake and talking. Really? Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, she's in there with my dad right now. You had Todd and Ming's child and you kept it from her. Wow, Dea. That's a mistake of your life, because he has to know. She said everything's gonna be all right, right? So do you feel better about your mom now? I will when she comes home. Oh, I understand. You want to see her with your own two eyes? No kidding. I'm not letting her out of my sight. Somebody has to keep her out of the hospital. Oh, now your Aunt Dorian is gonna take very good care of her. She's too busy with her stupid campaign. Now, do you really think that would keep her from helping somebody she loves? Look, she's on again. Oh, Miss Amelia Bennett? Rerunning a press conference. My new campaign manager. She is my partner. She is my fiance. <laughs> Aunt Dorian's a lesbian. When did that happen? No one asked you to lie. Yeah, well, you're sure not telling the truth. Oh, because I'm not in love with Dorian? I'm pretty sure she's not in love with you either. Who are we to define what makes a marriage? Isn't that exactly what we're fighting against? No, this is different. How? They tell us that our feelings aren't legitimate, that we don't have the right to marry, to have families. Who received the same tax credits, insurance benefits? Yeah, yes, yes, I believe in all of that, but why use a straight woman to get them? And believe me, she is straight. Funny story, I tried to get her into a menage a trois once, dismal failure. If we get what we want, what difference does it make? 
Because you're asking people to trust you. No, I'm asking people to trust our stance on the issue. We never lied about that. And you really think that'll make a difference when people find out the truth? How are they gonna find out, Oliver? Are you gonna tell them? Look. What are you doing with that briefcase? Are you asking if I'm gonna out you? Will I tell all of Landview that Dorian's the straightest woman I've ever known? You know, don't worry, that's not something I'd do. Then what is? Excuse me? You overheard Amelia and I talking at the Buenos Dias Cafe this morning. Nick, just let it go. No, okay. you were suspicious of me earlier. So obviously he told you something. Oliver didn't mean any harm. Okay, then maybe next time he can come to me with his concerns. Look, Nick, I'm a cop, okay? I, I thought it might be something illegal. What, at the rally? You said Dr. Lord was your target, and then Amelia mentioned pulling the trigger. We were speaking metaphorically. <laughs> Oliver didn't know that, okay? He, he thought that you you were planning an, uh, an assassination. <laughs> Assassination? So you pretend to be my friend. No, I wasn't pretending. He did it for me, okay? He knows I have to stay out of trouble. Okay, so Oliver is protecting you from me? This I mean, just like he tried to protect me from you. This is different. He overheard something he thought I should know. And you think people should know that my engagement to Dorian isn't real? Look, Oliver, we're not committing any crimes. People get married for all kinds of reasons. Don't you think fighting for our rights is as good as any? I know I want to marry the man I love. And someday, when you meet the right guy... Uh, Fish? Uh, yeah, I'll be right there. Um, I gotta go. Police business. Are you with us or against us? You should probably put him down as undecided. Well, this briefcase. No, it's, it's my briefcase. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Is that why it has the initials TD on it? Well, that's me. I'm, I'm uh, Tom Delancey. And you keep your briefcase at Mr. Manning's house. Okay, look, it's Teo Delgado's briefcase, but what's inside is mine. Yeah, nice try. No, 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 I'm serious. We're married. Or in the middle of a divorce. Uh, how stupid do you think I am? Tay is married to Todd Manning. Yeah, you, you might want to check your scorecard on that one, sweetheart. And you might want to hand that over. I need something in here. I'm not leaving without it. Over my dead body. Or maybe yours. Whatever. What, what, really? Oh, uh huh. <laughs> Feisty. I like that. Now move. Don't let this get ugly. Step aside, and nobody's gonna get hurt, okay? You mess with Noel, you mess with me, sucker. <laughs> 